Hey guys, Shaber1000 here. Today, we're going to do a review of the Shark Flyer. Stay tuned, let's check it out. Alright guys, this is what we got today. Uh, well, we didn't get it today, but you know what I mean. Uh, we got this when we went to uh, to the uh, Ripley's, believe it or not. We bought this there. Uh, we saw one, it, it was handwritten on the back on the price tag. It said $9.99. And we got to looking and... Uh, well, we was like, that's, that's pretty cheap because these things are like 30 bucks. And she asked the woman, and she said, oh, oh, well, they've been marked down. And on one of them, it was marked down from $29.99 to $19.99 to $14.99, and then the $9.99 in red pen, they kept scratching it out. So I grabbed one that had the regular price tag on it. Now they're selling them for $9.99, 10 bucks because they're not sell selling very well. So, let's go ahead and open this thing up. Um, I do know it has to be charged for, wow. Monkey's sending me a bunch of hearts and stuff. Uh, so, I do know you got to charge it. It charges uh, via USB. Uh, one rechargeable battery. Charging time is 15 minutes. Flying time 10 minutes. Now this is one of those things that hovers, and when it starts coming down, you put you just put your hand under it, and it picks it back up. So let me back you out here a little bit. Well, let's see what's going on here. But she said they wasn't selling very well, so. Sorry guys. So I got a new <laughs> I got a new uh, intro. I had to make a new intro. I lost everything on the computer. Everything. There was uh, some videos, paranormal videos on there. It's all gone. It's all gone. I had to do a clean install on it. There was nothing I could do. To say what I had to say, what was going on. So there he is. There's the shark flyer. And then they had one that was oh, what's his name? Um, Waldo. Like where's Waldo guy? They had that one. Well, for a guy that has a new pack of blades in there. Sure is taking his time putting blades on his knife, eh? Right. So I'm gonna open this up. Alright. And there's the charger. Okay, so I got it all taped up here. something I shouldn't cut like my finger so apparently you plug him into his foot right here and that's the eye that's what makes him hover when you put your hand and we're going to demonstrate it here in a minute but first we're going to have to get him to charge I guess it says shirt buttons light up in flight well I only see one button that can light up but hey you know it is what it is wait a minute there's a switch. There's another little hole there. Well, what's that one in the bottom for? I guess they're both some kind of eye. So apparently this plugs in here. Yeah, that plugs in there. And we're going to get him charged up. And I'll be back with you in 15 minutes. But for you, I'm going to be back in 3, 2, 1. Okay, guys. I'm back. I wanted to show you something. 
right here on the box it says charging time 15 minutes okay and on here it says charge your flyer no more than five minutes for optimal use I don't know if you can see that or not now <laughs> That's where they try to screw you if something happens and you take it back and well, how long did you charge it? Five minutes. Wasn't long enough. How long did you charge it? Fifteen minutes. Well, that's too long. So if they ever give you any static about something like this and they say, well, did you charge it long enough? Say, well, I tried both times. Both ways. I tried to charge it for five minutes like the instructions say and I also char tried to charge it for fifteen minutes. So if you have problems with these things, don't don't let them get you guys you know argue with that because Shea Bear don't play you know people spend their hard-earned money even if it's only 10 bucks what if it was 30 and you got this for your kid and it broke and they don't want to take it back you know and your kids are like all pissed off and you're pissed off and they don't care because they got their money they don't want to you know so if you get anything I don't care what it is a car part anything a product if you don't like it send it back don't be afraid to go I don't like this you know it's just not what I expected or I don't like it because it broke or I got it and, and I just don't like the damn thing I want my money back you know so there's that so let's get you up here and let's see if we can make this thing fly okay guys the instructions say to turn it on and wait two to three seconds for this thing to sorry got hairs on it two to three seconds and it should start it should want to take off so let's get you up here hope I don't hit the cat No way. Is it worth 10 bucks? Absolutely, it's worth 10 bucks. Uh, I haven't played it long enough. I suppose it says age is 8 and up. I suppose if you've got an 8 year old on, with it, it's probably not going to last all day. So, I mean, 
it is what it is, right? But it's not $30. It's not $20. It's not a $15 toy. $10 toy is plenty for this. So, you know, if you want to get you one, they sell them at, at, like, in shopping malls if you have any left. And uh, shopping centers and stuff, you'll see them demonstrating them. Uh, you might even get them cheaper online. I don't know. This one actually comes from Ripley's. It's actually Ripley's, believe it or not. So, but they, I do know they make other ones. They sell them in different places. I'm not sure how much they are, but they might even be better. But if you're at Ripley's and you see one of these for 10 bucks, you know, give it a shot. Uh, I mean, you know how your, your kid does with these toys or her toys. So, you know, maybe it'll last for them. Maybe it won't. I don't know. So there you go, guys. Uh, I'll give it a one thumbs up. You know, but uh, no more than that, and no more than ten bucks. Ten bucks is plenty for this thing. So that being said, guys, I'm gonna say I'm gonna huh. can't breathe. I'm gonna say Shea Bear, the myth, the man, the legend. I'm gone for now. Bye, bye, guys. Have a good one.